Hi, this is GM Props. As many of you requested, I have taken a Federation Mark 7 medical tricorder prop kit from Roddenberry.com, as you see here, and have designed a complete set of working electronics with lights and sounds. One of my challenges and objectives was to design a set of electronics that would easily fit into the standard vacuform type body uh, designed and created by Ed Majorecki. It was also necessary to design a better light panel that would uh, illuminate the beautiful slide that's supplied with the kit. And finally, electronics needed to be found that could accommodate the uh, finely crafted aluminum body scanner. Here are all the boards that will go inside of the uh, Mark 7 tricorder. If we apply some power to them, you will see everything come on. There's a couple new features on this uh, design that I did not incorporate in other tricorders. Number one, there's now a switch panel located right here that will be just above the view screen. The right hand button will mute the sound for you. As well, there are two other sounds. And with any medical tricorder, you always have to have a flat line sound. But there's also the ever popular scanning sound with an anomaly detected. These are the boards as follows. This here is the eight scrolling LEDs that fit inside the black pouch where the scanner goes. There are also two side LEDs. This piece here will go on the very top of the tricorder and just contains four scrolling lights and uh, uh, three solid lights. This board here is your standard standard top array which you find on all tricorders and also the sound module is located beneath there. And there's the speaker. The, here is the, uh, the button panel that we just demonstrated. The uh, buttons will control. This is the sound tricorder scan with anomaly. This is the flat line medical scan and this is the mute. This board here is the main alpha, beta, gamma, delta lights for the library uh, of the tricorder. This is uh, standard on most of the uh, Mark 6 and Mark 7 boards, Mark 7 tricorders. This here is a new feature I've added. It's a light board and with a thin film of um, like milk plex or uh, a diffuse, diffuse type of plastic, you can uh, use it to light up the slide that comes with the kit. It becomes like a light, a light box. This is your door board where the emergency light will go and the ID light over here. And I'll show you the scanner in a second. The scanner is actually a modified Mark 10 medical scanner. It contains eight rotating green LEDs and one large red LED. The switch has been modified to line up with the scanner on the aluminum body. This wonderfully done aluminum body unscrews to allow you access to the battery compartment and the top will come off to give you easier access for mounting the electronics. The red LED will mount directly into the hole and should line up the green LEDs with the slots on the sides. Green, small green pieces have been added to the kit from Roddenberry so that you can glue them into place in these slots. The green LEDs below will light up those green pieces of plastic and make it look like larger LEDs. This is how the scanner looks when running. In total, there are eight separate circuit boards for this tricorder. 
The entire tricorder can be run on one 6 volt battery. I highly recommend either using a rechargeable lithium ion battery pack or you can use four AAA batteries in a cell holder. The scanner uh, can be run with one 6 volt uh, battery or four small 1.3 volt uh, pill batteries.